and welcome back. Once again, we're back to Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro 2, the most non-functional simulated Yu-Gi-Oh! player in existence. And today we have another deck. This time we're actually doing my favorite deck of all time. Last time we did my favorite archetype, this time it's definitely my favorite. I've never played deck that I was more hyped and more just loving every second of doing it. So let's take a look at that right now. And here it is, boys. Oh boy, this is a doozy. Supreme King Zark deck. Wow, I, I don't know really what to say about it. It's, it's just, it's fantastic. If you have never played this, make this build. Like, I recommend this build. Uh, the three Odysseys up here, they are kind of a throw-in. I just couldn't really think of, think of anything else to put there, but you can switch them out. They're they're good they're good beaters if you need. They are I don't know, dark pendulum, so you can make this you can I get I mean it's technically a target for this since it's a pendulum dragon. Mm, I don't know. Uh, but you can do whatever you want with that. Uh I, I just I like this setup the most. You could play three wisdom eye, but often you end up activating pendulum calls, so you're never gonna get to pop this effect. But yeah, I, I'm not going to talk too much about this right here. We're going to just get right into the duels. And oh boy, I have a feeling we're going to get some interesting one stuff.
those were the duels. Um, like I said, uh, it works pretty damn well. Like, this time I didn't get an AI that completely bricked. There was actual back and forth there to some degree. Zark is... Well, it has the name Supreme King for a reason. It, it deserves that name. And you can see the basic combos, what the deck can do. Like, you saw the this uh, Pendulum Craft of Space Time, which is actually... You know, wait, no, that's the TCG name as well. Oh, I didn't rem remember. Um, like, this, this trap makes the deck. It's so powerful when you mix it with a Pendulum Call, where basically you play Pendulum Call your turn, search the two, set the field, set this, your opponent's turn, you can pop a card from your opponent's side of the field, your, yours gets protected by Pendulum Call, and then you can just send one card from their field to the graveyard. It's such a powerful card. And you can do it actually when they're trying to blow up your, sp your um, Pendulum Scale, so you can just use this, blow them up yourself, and then remove something from them. So you can minus your opponent when they're trying to minus you. It's it's really good. Um, you didn't really get to see this at, at all, Pendulum Scale Ages. This is basically just a searcher. A top of all the searching that this deck already does. It's it's crazy. Like you didn't even like in those duels you didn't even get, get to see half of what this deck can do. Like it can pop three of these in one turn, just start doing crazy combos. But you get to see the use of uh, these two. This is this is a bit rare, it's basically just there for the Supreme King's Wrath, which is one of my favorite trap cards. And I also love the uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! wiki article on this, where you go to the card tips, it just says if your opponent... It, no, no, without replay, your opponent is doomed. I, I have a... Uh, I, I think I have a picture of it somewhere. I'm, just, I'm gonna put it here. It, 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 it's amazing. It, it's just great. Uh, if, if I remember, I'll, I'll put it somewhere in the video. But yeah, that that's, that's Supreme King's Ark. I... Cannot recommend it enough. It is fantastic. Basically, all of these cards you can get. Actually, these. Two, actually, yeah. Every monster card. Uh, Pendulum call. Pendulum ages and Pendulum space time you can get from the Pendulum evolution set. So basically, if you, I made this deck. Uh, I actually have it in real life. Um, I made it by just buying one box of it, and you basically get all of this, and these. Then, well, you have to get Zark from previous sets. Duelist Alliance comes out in the same set as Zark. Duelist Alliance, actually, I think it has, like, it's 7 to $8 right now. I'm not sure. Dating the video. And these are from Code of the Duelist. So, yeah, this is a fantastic deck. Doesn't work in the Link format at all. Just absolutely not at all. Don't even try it. You, you, you're maybe able to summon... I've managed to summon Zark once, and you basically have to hold that field. If you can't hold it, you lose. You basically have to bring out Zark for turn one. So yeah, um, that's it. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Again, if if there's... if the, I'm actually going to be taking... Commission, if there's a, if there's a particular tech deck you want me to look at, uh, just post put it in the comments, put the deck name, uh, you don't need to put a build. I'll, I'll probably... I mean, if you want, you can, but I'll probably build something on my own version. Just put a deck name. Uh, if it's something a bit more complicated, you might put some key cards there. If it's not, like, a specific archetype, it's just a collection of cards. Or you can link me to uh, net, decking or net deck or something, and I'll lo look into it and see if we can do something with that. But, with that said, hope you enjoyed. I had a lot of fun playing this here. And I hope you hope I see you guys next time. Bye bye.